<laughs> Hello YouTube, I am Jerry. I am usually accompanied by the lion, some of you may know. But currently I am here with the professor, also known as Xavier. And today we shall be playing some tanks. Now we've already decided to play a certain tier. And if you don't know what World of Tanks is, I'll link it in the description. It's basically a first person shooter, but with tanks. Do you have anything to add, Xavier? Not really. <laughs> Not really, huh? Well, I'm, I'm gonna have to tell you though, the uh, T-34 2G there, he's going to be a decent player, so watch out for him. Uh -huh. Yeah, so... I know it I sounds a little forced. But I'm just gonna have to deal with it. Have to take this little pea shooter of mine and go somewhere. So where are you going? I guess I'll follow you. Oh, I was planning on following you. I'll follow him. Oh no, that's a light tank. Well, he, you can still follow him. You're a light tank as well. Just don't camp too hard. Oh hey, I spotted something. Yep. Very interesting, all this. So how are you doing? Pretty well. Oh, that's good to hear. I say we be uh, extremely aggressive and hope to get some damage in before things happen. Oh, you kill stealer. <laughs> okay, push me like that. <laughs> Just scoop. Ow. I took a shot for you. <laughs> yeah, thanks for that. Hmm. Kinda un kinda under fire here. Yes. Hmm. <laughs> Let's see if yeah. I just can't get some other things here. Yeah. I say we're doing pretty good. You know, they used to be super aggressive. The tricky part is taking out the hedge monkey here. He, he knows what he's doing. Yeah, with the Irish accent. <laughs> I, I could start talking to him, but I think I'd annoy the few viewers I do get. <laughs> yeah, it, it's all just part of the plan. I think I'll just sit here for a bit. Kind of force this guy's hand. Oh, he fired. I'll just destroy his cover. Uh -huh, uh oh, taking hits. Take that, you Chinese. You tank. I forget. Chinu is what? Japanese? Mm, I think. Yeah. I, I think the Chinu is Japanese. Yeah. Yeah, this game went south really fast. <laughs> Got him. Uh, risk. 
Yep, the risk. It's real. Yeah, that's a Japanese tank. Intriguing. Care to play another one? Eh, why not? Yeah, I mean, we've got some time. Yeah. Do 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 do. What do you suppose we play this time? Sevens or sixes? I think I'll go with the seven. Play a bit of scumbaggery artillery. <laughs> I, I think that should be the scientific name of artillery. Scumbaggy artillery. You know, it kind of rhymes. Yeah. Kind of goes with it. Indeed. Although, after the artillery reworks, I've... The gun on the M12, it's not as accurate as compared to, like, the Lorraine 51. But it fires so much faster, and that that's something I'm liking about this. The only downside is I just can't carry in any of my artillery like I used to. Because with the artillery rework that came a couple patches ago, the damage res was reduced and stun was introduced. And so, as a result, I just can't seem to kill as many tanks as usual, and it is what it is. Although it doesn't stop everyone from hating artillery, because I think a lot Bleh. of people have that special little place in their heart where they just absolutely loathe and despise all artillery players. And you know, to a certain degree, I can kind of agree with that. Because artillery's in a bad position and kind of always has been. I'd gotten me some more Kool-Aid though. Oh well. Yeah. How are you doing up there? Pretty well. Took two shots, pinned both. Oh, that's good. Yeah, that's definitely good. LTP. Too bad yeah. you probably can't hit him. With him moving back. Dinging. No, it's the, the phrase is uh, was that floating like a butterfly or stinging like a bee? I think that's the phrase. Oh, hey. We've kind of lost the base because the camping IS-3 is camping. I hope he brought some really delicious marshmallows. Oh boy. I'm going to get to hit two targets. One. Which is always nice. Now someone would actually shoot the targets I'm hitting. I've got the rear of this tank here. Barely kill barely It almost knocks him out. Almost. Oh, our, here's the light tank. Do what a light tank always used to do. 
Bleh. Bad teammates. Oh. Oh, come on. What? Oh. I, I, I shotgun the LTTV, which is a rare occurrence, and he makes it. He, By 27 hit points. Yeah, a whole 27 hit points, and he doesn't die. You see, before the rework, that would have killed us both. Oh well. I guess there's just plenty more games to always have. Really would be nice if the squeaking lion was here. <laughs> he always seems He's... to know what to talk about and when to talk about it. Because, honestly, I mean, this is like my first video with actual voice chat. Because yeah. I don't... I never did record any of the videos Lion helped make. And so, I guess it's just something you ha you get used to. Yeah. Hmm. You. KV twos. Yeah, KV twos. When in doubt, KV two. Because Soviet Russia. When in doubt, KV twos roll out. Yep. <laughs> in Russia, you don't shoot tank, tank shoot you. Ow. <laughs> yeah, it's like getting shot out of a, one of those circus cannons, but with a lot more death. Mostly for you. Big ball of fire. And that... And all that's left of you is a little pile of ash just spread out all over the place. This should definitely be interesting. Top tiers are light tanks and not really much in the way of heavy tanks. Let's see. I think we should try and derp a few into the lightly armored vehicles they have. Should net us quite a lot of damage if we can hit. Do you still not have your mark of excellence? I don't even know how, but I should have it by now. Should, but it never got it. Mm. With the tier 10 light tanks being introduced along with their tier 9 counterparts, the uh, premium light tanks such as the M4190 GF and the AMX 1357 Grand Final are in better spots than ever because they get normal matchmaking like every tank gets now. Except they nerfed just about all the other light tanks to fit them in to the minus two plus two matchmaking. And so, since they won't ever nerf premium tanks, the M4190 is basically, in every respect, better than the Bulldog, which, not to mention, basically got neutered with its 10-shot autoloader being removed. Actually, not necessarily removed, just reduced to like over more than half its capacity removed, but still the same like 30 plus second reload. Really stupid move. Very good thing I uh, got the T49 before they bumped it up. There's 
hardly anything out here. It's like everything's camping base. Which is a bad thing. Oh yeah, especially since we have hardly any view range. This VK is getting nailed by E25s. There's not much we can do can do until we get some light tank support. Tiger to your right. They just won't shoot down this group building here. It's like all they have to do, and they, they can just shoot me. Yep. Not only are these boogers hard to spot, they're even harder to kill. Because they're quick and they have a fast reload. Oh yeah, they they get a tier 5 gun. Except it reloads like a full second faster, so... Every time you blink, they're firing. <laughs> Although, I am now starting to question why I bothered to reinstall the extended visualization mod. Granted I haven't gotten real salty, but it's just... I, I kind of stopped using mod packs altogether before the last patch before that this came out. Just because I, I got tired of using XVM and Seeing that people, it was telling people the stats of everyone else. Although lately I've realized that I get focused by artillery a lot more. And it's not that hard to believe that I'm um, that focused focusing is a thing. Right over the tank. So far over the tank, it wasn't funny. It was a mile up. Although it's nice to know that recording doesn't harm my FPS too bad. It only drops at like 30 frames. Wow. Yep. What to do? What to do? Oh, hey, I'm spotted. Can't do a thing about it. Yep. Can't do a thing about it. Did you ever get a locust? No. Go to tankacademy.com and go get yourself a free locust. And seal club to the maximum. 
to the maximum laws. Yep. Do, do you at least have a tier 3? Yeah. Well, that's good. You know, I picked up... Oh, what was it? Like, 800 damage earlier this day. Although, I dodged when I should have weaved, and I got knocked out. I got some decent credits for it, though, which is always nice. Tank Rewards or Tank Academy? TankAcademy.com Although it might be under a different address. I'll find the link for it and give it to you and put in, put it in the description. Along with the uh, invite code to World of Tanks, which will get you a Churchill 3, I think 300 gold, and a week of premium time. Basically, you get one of these things. Fires even faster than those E25s I was telling you about. It's so gorgeous. They put it in an HD model last batch. Here, I'll just take this. Alright, suits me. Club all the seals. Yes, we must club. Oh, hey! Tier, tier twos. Ooh, even better. Yeah. So you can just, like, machine them all down. God, I don't even need to use my grease gun. Well, then what do you use? Your ramming speed? Oh. <laughs> Now that I think about it, yeah, it gun on this tank is like a grease gun. Hmm. Still nothing like the uh, T7 combat car. Like, yeah, this versus best, that. That the best tank for all those Patriot machine gunning people. The thing literally has a machine gun. I'm hoping to track one of these guys. I guess not. It's only a matter of time before the artillery starts trying to fire. You know, I'm gonna rush through the middle. If you want to club seal, you gotta do it just right with enough finesse. Hey, both tanks are destroyed as I'm passing by. Alright, come on, Xavier. This poor sucker doesn't even realize it yet. Let's just leave some carnage. Ooh, could we make some moves? Alright, you can go... Let's see. Where's the artillery? They couldn't have gone far. I'm going to go help Hill on the other side. Alright. I'll just take care of this artillery. Third artillery. 
Kills of artillery leave the M2. I say you can get four kills as well. And then we would have that brother, whatever. Ah, oh, there we go. A nice 650 damage. Actually, it's 225. 671. And I luckily haven't needed to go into my APC armor shells. You just rammed that guy? Leave the M2 for me. We both get 5 kills. Lol. Nah, I'm going to get the M2 if I can't help it. I need to get myself another top gun medal. Never. <sighs> I'll race you to it. <laughs> well, I know you're faster. Oh, my ping lag. No. Alright, you beat me. <laughs> you complain about ping. I'm getting 200 right now. Oh no, he went around the corner. And the team's closing in on him. I might not be able to get him. Yep, He's probably going to dirt this other guy. <laughs> How dare you? Both got five kills, so. Yep. Which is always nice to kill two thirds of the enemy team. Oh hey, that's my first Dumitis medal. Destroy Yay. three enemy SPGs in a battle. Brothers in Arms. That's my first one. Your first? My first. That's why I was trying to get the last kill. Oh. Shall we do that again and clear some... No, just club some more seals? Yes. I had fun. Oh, yeah. Clubbing seals is always fun. Oh, yeah. Unless you turn out to be the seal getting clubbed while trying to seal club. As long as we're top tier, we can make it. Oh yeah. Alright, I'm going to stop. <laughs> hey, but why you got to stop then? Because... Maybe bad. Hi. Well, I have no idea what accent you're trying to do, but I think I'll just do I... just a tad bit of my Irish. Probably sounds know what... bad for me to an actual Irish speaker. Yeah. Never know. Yeah, never know. Um, comment below. <laughs> yeah, comment below. Do you think my Irish accent's good? Because I honestly don't know. I'm not really knowing any Irish speakers. Although, it gets better once I've gotten into it. Then I get stuck on it. Ow. Ooh. That's a lot of machine gun fire. Oh my gosh. There's machine gun fire from like four different tanks at once. <laughs> oh, that was crazy. There's visual effects on that. Oh, that was crazy awesome. Oh, this poor L60 flipped over. Charge! Wow, the West Vest spot uh, shot me and it, he turned blue. The West shot you? Yeah. Well then, you shouldn't be shooting your own teammates. He accidentally shot me.
that was nice. Almost got another brothers in arms. <laughs> That's like the only downside with this tank is a low ammo capacity. Oh, I have 640 bullets. Well, yeah, you've got 640. And 40 shells are clip. Oh, hey. This, uh, Han guy 1966 is asking me mm -hmm. a tip for a new player. Uh, what is it? Look at I got Bruiser, Hands of God, uh, Fire for Effect, and Mastery Badge Class 2. I have to say I'm making quite a bit of credits off of this, which is quite a, quite hilarious. Let's try that again. Try it again? Okay. Oh yeah, definitely. Oh, it's fun. Actually, back out. Oh, wait. Oh. oh. Well. That pawn. I tried. That pawn person wanted to keep talking with me. I'll just have to talk with him after the video. Alright. Seems like a nice enough fellow. And you know, he's already better than a large portion of the player base. You wanna know why? Huh. He realizes he's not good at the game and he wants to learn how to get better. A lot of yeah, these bad... guy. <laughs> yeah. A lot of these bad players don't even realize they're bad. And they think they're like the best players in the world and anyone else that defeats them are like cheaters or whatever. Not to say that there aren't some cheaters, just not very common. Darn pop-ups. Who's firing? Oh, just him. You know, well, hey, what's artillery doing? I think we need to take him out. There he is. He's still right there, just blind fire him a few times. You see? And that is not cheating. It's just using your brain. Actually, you know, the only other side of charge him. Get a lock on this type. I'm mad that an M2 medium used heat on me. <laughs> <laughs> It's Ooh, much easier to day. use gold ammo. That served me like butter. Oh yeah. Side of the Exalta. Or Electo. Yep, Electo. Let the team kill him. Oh my goodness. Let's see. The guy's aiming at you. Enemy armor is damaged. I didn't 
realize I was still spotted. Get that electo. Yeah, let's not die. Uh, Give me a second. I'll, like, bear it back. Alright. It should be over by then. It's only a, just a matter of finding out how to advance. would actually go off from time to time. Alright. Now oh, you're back. Mm -hmm. Let's see. Can I use the power of bushes? How did that person overturn their vehicle? Since when do 228s have that much armor? Since armor. Yeah, but I almost never have issues penetrating 228s. I've only got 13 rounds left. It's the premium T28. Yeah, yeah. Still didn't realize it had more armor. <laughs> the powers of being little. Yep. I guess you can only try and win so many, right? Yeah. Alright, well I think that cuts it for this episode of World of Tanks. Goodbye, YouTube. Peace.